Good afternoon. Welcome to the Midday Mole for Tuesday, the 22nd of the 2nd, 2022. No doubt the school kids had a great fun writing the date today, um, and worth taking note of. But we continue reading the scriptures with Robert Murray McShane today, continuing with Paul's first letter to the Corinthians in chapter 9, where Paul looks at his rights as an apostle and says, I don't hold on to them. I give them up in order to advance my ministry. But I struck by what he says in verse 20 and following, where he says, To the Jews I become like a Jew, to win the Jews. To those under the law I become like one under the law, though I myself am not under the law, so as to win those under the law. To those not having the law I become like one not having the law, though I am not free from God's law, but am under Christ's law, so as to win those not having the law. To the weak I become weak to win the weak. I've become all things to all people so that by all possible means I might save some. Now this almost goes against what we've been thinking in the past where we I've said that as Christians we are distinctive. We're not going to fit into the world and we need to recognize that. We stand apart um, very often and we're not going to be popular. And here Paul says we've, we need to fit in. Um, and we need to have the, the two in balance. Um, and so if I want to evangelize a motorcycle gang, I can't go in my pinstripe, pinstripe suit looking like I'm going to the local uh, bank board meeting or to the uh, reformed church on the corner. They will just ignore me or laugh at me. I need to fit in with them and dress like a biker. And there are many Christians who are part of the biking community doing just that. Um, and so what Paul is saying is for people to listen to us, they need to be able to relate to us. And therefore, we've got to appear to be like them. We've got to become like them, but always recognizing that we are different. Paul says, I become like one under the law, even though I'm not under the law myself. I become like one that doesn't have the law, but I recognize I do have a law over me. And so um, most of us aren't going to be called to evangelize the biking community. If you do, we pray that you, <laughs> you have great success. But we are going to be part of social functions and go to, to tea at people's houses and, and join in the local uh, school parents association or the local um, community forum or whatever it is. And we need to go there fitting in that people can relate to us. And when they do that, they will suddenly realize we look like them, we talk like them, we are almost like them, but we're not quite. There is a difference. And that will pique their interest, and that will often become the opportune time to share the gospel. What is it that we look like we're the same as them, but we, we, we're different, and we can share that difference with people. So be encouraged to, uh, to go out into the world, to... If you're going out amongst the, the Jews, as Paul says, become like a Jew. If you're going amongst the, 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 the Gentile, become like a Gentile. If you're going to the biking community, become like a biker. And we do those things in order that we can be a light in that space and that we might have an opportunity to share the good news of Jesus. Be encouraged as you do that and be blessed.